All right, so let's keep moving forward. Um, yeah, right now, actually, we were trying to uh, use our settler to finally get something uh, decent <laughs> to back up our capital, because so far I've been uh, we running behind in technology and everything. So, and I'm also I'm going be, I'm gonna try to capture that uh, Egyptian settler. Um, there's no point to be in peace with these guys because no matter what they're gonna try to attack me sooner or later so what about now so yeah exactly um, so with my army of can uh, shake there we're able to take care of the their warriors and now with the archer we're finally getting a free settler another free settler so we <coughs> gonna expand and also we have another um another settler so we can probably gonna try to find another like a decent location it's kind of tough especially because uh, we are we are too close with the rest but uh trying to find a location to to open another city so yeah i know everybody's discussed with me with the culture but uh, <laughs> even me <laughs> uh so now i guess everybody's gonna start asking me for things um so well but the, the good, the good, the good thing is was I was able to 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 get some defenses in all my cities. So all the cities at least have some a couple archers. So I sh should be fine for now. And with Kenshik, I'm gonna try to build a couple armies and and that way um, trying to attack the probably the German or the well in this case the they're the Roman right I think right now we are in, in war with the German and yeah no the German and the Egyptian because of the settler but uh, um let's see if we can steal something from Rome with my spy and uh, this is not like at the best location but at least we have a, a mountain very close and with the ox we should be getting some food and production for that tile so so it's not too bad considering how bad everything it looks like right now um for that settler probably we're gonna move it north and see if we can find something uh, another good location uh, i'm gonna try to clean the area uh i want to see my kenshig army going down with first to be warriors <laughs> um yeah we still have that city very close to to go down in in the Egyptian hands because of the the culture so uh, we're just gonna keep an eye on that city uh, as I mentioned before we're not gonna do anything fancy we're not gonna build anything just units and if I lost the city because of culture I'm gonna try to remove all my units from there so I can recapture the city right away mm -hmm. um, yeah, that's the only problem with all these small cities. is kind of hard to actually don't even have that much production either. So it's not that you can have like a thousand of soldiers coming. But um, yeah, I know, I know. It's going down. It's going down. It's going to try to use my warriors as a chalk point in there. I'm trying to protect that new expansion and... Uh, I told you it's not that great for now. And um, probably in the in the moment here, I'm gonna I should be able to to get uh, more production from that mountain. So and with the iron mine, we should be able to get um, like a five production hammers from that mountain. So for now, is 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 good enough. We're just trying to survive uh, and trying to. Uh, get as much as possible from the uh, for the capital. That's the only one that is holding my my science production. So we're gonna keep moving our scan cheek, trying to get real any any possible unit before they become an army. Uh, and I understand the German is kind of pissed, so <laughs> we need to be ready. Uh, just a heads up. Remember, we're going back and we're going. I'm trying to get uh, mathematics now so we can <coughs> try to get catapult as soon as possible 
Uh, let's see if we can get some gold. Oh, this is that's just a joke. Should get more gold just selling this pie. And uh, well, sometimes you just need to play around, see what happens. Um, yes, yeah, so right now I'm gonna just gonna start building oh, something. Uh, Still not sure what I'm gonna do in the capital. So at least the production is not gonna get lost if I'm if I'm building the barracks for now. And, uh, oh, uh, kidok. Uh, okay, so you see, we we just lost our city because of the cult, but with my Kenshi, we were able to <laughs> recover uh, that back as a uh, right away. Um, that's the whole idea. So now we can keep producing more, more units, more basic uh, warriors, Kenshi or archers without building any walls or temple uh, there is no point to save that city at all so but so far the, the game is still still uh, I'm, I'm not sure it's an unknown reserve uh, I'm not really sure how how we're gonna pull off this if I'm gonna keep those cities or not and now the Roman is pushing yeah, I can see the Roman is moving forward too. Uh, but yeah, with all those small cities, and it is yeah, I think you guys noticed that uh, we were able to get a bunch of small uh, units. So okay, so we're gonna. Uh, oh, nice! This is a good location. We have two die. Um, yeah, we had die over there, over there. Nice. So now, if we get monarchy, we'll be we'll be in great, great shape. I mean, we can use that one as a science city. Um, so for now, you're gonna just keep the city as producing, uh, growing as much as possible. We we take that the advantage of the of the irrigation bonus. But uh, I'm gonna we're gonna build some defenses, uh, some archers. That's that's basic. I mean, you always need to do that, okay, no matter what. Every time you you conquer, you find new cities, build your defenses, and, and before start producing anything. I mean, then you can uh, later round find out and say, okay, probably this is gonna be good for science, good for units. But uh, the beginning is always rush, rush archers or any defensive units. Um, so right now we are under siege by everybody. Uh, the big problem that all those crappy small cities they have the their borders are horrible. You see the Egyptian already is moving, is taking control of the whole south. And uh, just gonna try to keep these legions out of the uh, away from this city so I can <coughs> recover that one as uh, right away. And also I can yeah exactly I can take advantage and be able to uh, promote my my army of Kanchik which is actually is holding the fort in the south uh, but uh but so far we have a we, we have some kind of control of the it doesn't mean we're dominating the game but uh, if you guys know that we have differences in all our cities so it's not like a uh, we're we we live in uh the city's but naked <laughs> of course we we always need to keep something in there and a uh, little by little we we have two s new cities right one with two uh die which are, are gonna help us a lot for the uh for the science perspective uh, but it's very important to try to get monarchy uh as soon as possible um for the other city that we just found the first settler um I still don't know what we're gonna do. I mean, it was just a. Um, probably I should keep that one. That settler in another. Put it, that settler in another location, but. Uh, well, there's no point. I, if I have all the cities closed, at least I, they're easy to to defend, so that's fine. Uh, we're gonna always keep some units. If you have a a hill uh, in front of your city like like that one for example it's always important to keep an archer or 
a defensive unit in there because if your enemy take the advantage of the heal, you're gonna receive plus 50% in attack, and uh, that's that's too much. That's that's uh, it's like uh, giving yourself away. So it's not good. Always keep uh, uh, some units in the in their healing if you have a heal very close to your to your cities. Okay, no, 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 don't build just city, I mean, <coughs> a defense for your city itself. So you can also build an army and put in that heal and make sure that your, your opponent is not going to take advantage, especially if you play against uh, uh, people. Okay, Whoa, because that, that's uh, that is one of the best way to to attack a city, find any, any kind of weakness, and in that case, uh, a heal can make a... Uh, Hugely <coughs> different when you're attacking or defending. So right now, I guess we can hold that area. Oh crap! Okay, now the Germans coming with armies of legions. So hopefully, we're gonna get mathematical soon, so we can start um, getting some catapult. Mm -hmm. All right, that, that wasn't that was that wasn't pretty. Uh, once again, I'm keeping those Kenshik close to that city, so I can I were able to defend the. Nice. Okay, so we finally got. Um, we finally got the, the catapults. Yeah, literacy probably should be good, so we can uh, try to get the core house. But uh, right now, our remember we're gonna always trying to find the easiest way to get to. To steam power, I mean, I mean to uh, to combustion. But in the meantime, literacy will be fine. Uh, we need this courthouse as soon as possible. Uh, as I mentioned before, we're gonna keep those Kenshi close to the base, uh, so we can recover that city uh, right away in case that they're trying to take it. And uh, and we have the advantage because we are protecting from a hill, so that's why it's so important. Uh, in this case, as uh, you guys uh, can uh, can see the 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 guy is trying to attack from from that hill and that actually could cause a lot of trouble uh, it's not like I'm gonna lose a big city I mean it's uh, just a piece of crap but uh, uh, it is like a, my my advanced uh, advan advanced barracks that I have to in order to to prepare my attack against the Japanese and the Egyptian so uh, this is probably the, the the phase of the game where the toughest part of the game because for now we just hold them um, trying to survive another day and building as many units as possible right now I'm gonna start focusing all my production in getting some catapults uh, because they're very useful in defense also and, uh, and as sooner or later actually I need to start working in um, get rid of the Roman or the German because if if I let this coin until the uh, the modern era is gonna be actually hell I don't think it's gonna be able to survive in the middle of the map and be, being, at, being attacked for everybody um, so right now we're gonna try to get monarchy uh, use that die that we have close to one hour new uh, cities and with this army of Kenshi, we should be able to to hold the fort. And uh, okay, we're gonna get the scout. Yeah, I, lo I love the, the scout upgrade because I can take a peek, take a look to what the defense looked like for the my enemies. So instead of going like a blind and move all my troops and like crazy, I prefer to take a look and see how the odds are how the odds are working. Maybe it's not necessary to attack yet. So we finally got the library here. So we're gonna probably use our um, all our population in research, uh, trying to catch a little bit if we can get monarchies. That would be awesome. Uh, otherwise, um, I don't know. Trying to find the easiest path to reach combustion. Uh, if we if we are able to risk combustion before anybody, that will be great. So we can start taking down everybody. 
more faster so right now let's see what happened in the next video we're moving very slow but i'm just trying to show the whole idea all right